Hey there, I run here and welcome to my 200th subscriber special. <laughs> That's right, we made it 200 subscribers. Matter of fact, I had posted my video the other day uh, asking who would be the 200th subscriber, and before I even got that particular video out, we had reached number 200. And the actual 200th subscriber is Corridor Gaming. That's right. But uh, but I want you to know that all of you all are special. And you all, all rock. And I appreciate each one of you very much. I remember when I started my channel about a year and a half ago. I set out to make a family friendly channel. And I remember even getting some feedback at the time that, um, you know, you'll never make it if you're not um, controversial or rude or something that nobody will want to watch you. And, you know, I just kind of believed in the values of making it family friendly and, you know, it just kind of worked out. And it worked out because of all of you that agree as well. So just want to say a big thank you to each of you. You all rock. And hold on, I am going to find some place to sleep the night away, and then we will be right back. All right, we are back, and I am at a litmus's place. So you probably don't recognize this particular server. We got Stargate Muffin. We got Planaire. We got Muffin 13 and a Litmus. A Litmus is, a Litmus is one of my sons. You know, uh, as I stated in on my channel, that one of the reasons why I got into Minecraft and even some of the videos and stuff was to stay connected with my kids. So, um, and when I say kids, all of my kids are adults now. But um, Anyway, and if you're wondering, I'm running back over here because you saw that one sheep the other day. I came on real briefly and um, set out to try to find some wool to make a bed, and there wasn't any. And someone told me that if I ran this way, I would run into some sheep eventually, and I did. And, and of the three that I started off with, uh, only one made it back. And not because one died or anything, but, well, if you've tried to, hold on a second, let me eat, it'll be noisy. If you've ever tried to get animals, sometimes they just lose interest or you get too far away from them and they lose track. I left one right over here in this area although the main bunch was way over there so I'm hoping that it's still gonna be right over here so I don't have to run all the way back I'm seeing a pig so um, I know I just gave you guys an update the other day but just kinda of fill you in I am still gonna be hanging out on a firmer craft I'm still trying to get over to DadCraft. Um, my job changed a little bit, and I've had to put a lot of time there. I mean, you should anyway, but... Um, so, I've been trying to concentrate on that by still, still gaming. I got a little bit burnt out on Minecraft, to be quite honest, after Exile um, shut down, and... Uh, except for doing the uh, ice plane spikes because it's it's kind of like this right here this is explorer exploring and adventuring there we go and I'm just going to try to get one more back and if I get one more back we can start breeding um, but I do have some other games I picked up medieval engineers the other day I also now have Daisy, thanks to my son at Litmus. Um, he bought it for me for my birthday. Yes, right, I celebrated a birthday recently. 
And so I have Daisy. He plays Daisy as well. Of course, I'm still playing Nether. I'm doing a lot of the uh, the PVE now, and I'm even thinking about adding a Nether PVE Basics 101. I know I've done a lot of tutorials. Uh, the PVE servers, I think, uh, allow for a little bit more ability to do some of the tutorials. The only problem is um, <laughs> I, I had already done um, tutorials on fixing uh, high-rise uh, tower and train yard, uh, those particular safe uh, safe zones, outposts, and um, I want to do some of the cities, but because there's really no chance of actually getting killed by PVPers. I mean, everybody hops in together. And the other day, I ran over to a museum, and I was going to show you guys how to secure it, even if you were by yourself. And I was too late. Everybody had already gotten there right before me. And I mean, it's good because it's a group effort. And uh, if you're playing it, you get everybody gets the points for it. But on certain things it makes it kind of difficult to make some videos so I've just been kind of hanging out with people in there making new friends um, and if you play just give me a holler but um, I started the Sniper Elite 3 series and my PlayStation 4 came in so I've been um, trying to figure out what to do with the PlayStation 4 I mean I'm going to do something with it but I'm trying to find a game to play. I mean, I could play Minecraft on it, but I'm already playing Minecraft on PC. And to be quite honest, the PC version is just better. <laughs> I don't know any other way to put it. There is no other way to put it. So, um, so I'm trying to find a game on that that I can enjoy and that we can uh, share together here on YouTube and Twitch. So I'm trying to be a lot more active in Twitch. So if you haven't seen me over there or subscribe to my Twitch channel go over there it's it's I run 365 on Twitch and um, so we got medieval engineers just came out Daisy uh, sniper elite I got the PS4 I still got nether I got Minecraft I got I spike planes I got this particular uh, realms it's a um, actually it's a Minecraft realms server that my son owns with some of his friends and uh, matter of fact I'll be trying to show you around there's a couple of guys on here that are again they're just incredible I mean they have a whole sorting stacking you name it system going on let's just get this one guy back and we'll be done with that so um, but yeah I just want to say thank you all because like I said when I started out um, there was a few people that just said you know you you got to have one of those obnoxious personalities and I always really kinda of follow the lead of Paul Soros Jr. that's who I learned to play Minecraft from and he always had a family friendly channel and I like that so I want um, uh, young people old people in between people moms dads kids teenagers whoever you are to be able to watch without being concerned and you know that's part of it so let me get this sheep in here there we go no piggy you guys make babies so I actually need to make a bed that's why I started doing this um, this is my little place right over here right now I runs abode I have that and then if you come around the, the bottom side there's a bottom entrance it is not decorated I basically just got a ladder going up and down I did not build this it was pre-built um, all the inside little barracks type things were already taken 
and they told me I could hang out there. So I got a lot to do on here. Let's go down here real quick. Um, I think it's, is it down here? Maybe not. Oh, I've never been in this part. Okay, so <laughs> they made an enchantment room up here. So you guys are seeing this with me for the first time because I hadn't seen this either. That's pretty neat. Creative. So I guess it's right here. Here we go. So they got different levels. They have different things here. Here's a chicken, chicken, chicken cooker. It's a chicken cooker. There's some farms, your carrots, your potatoes. So we won't go hungry. And these people are already ready to trade. So we can do that. Go down this level. Not only is that the chicken cooker, but here's a beef cooker. So hold on a second, let me turn down the animal sounds. Let me just turn that down for a little bit for a minute. So I can show you this. So basically it is a multi uh, function device. So you can put it up to the water and that raises them up so you can breed them. And then once they bred you can do that not sure what happens there I guess they go down this particular case if I put it down here whenever they're ready I'll actually get cooked beef if it's up you get the raw beef um, if you go this way you can go down and actually kill them I'm not sure exactly where you go probably that way but that allows you to get the experience as well but if you just want that as soon as they grow up they'll get scorched I mean scorched scorched anyway so I just want to show you that but most of all I just want to say thank you guys for being the awesome subscribers um, you know 200 subscribers who would have thought of that just well not even a year and a half ago about a year I started December of 2013, right? So a year and about a quarter. Yeah. So thanks for all of you. Stay tuned. We got more coming. Uh, again, uh, I've been trying to uh, game with some people. If you want to um, play some on Nether if you have the game or if you want to play some on Sniper Elite or whatever, just uh, leave me a message. But until next time... Thanks for watching, and we will see you guys. Ooh, that makes me dizzy. Next time. And we appreciate all of you. Thanks. See ya.